percolating right now just under the surface. Agreed. All it's going to take, all it's going to take, and, and you and I probably, we can't predict when this is going to happen, how it's going to happen, but there's going to be a couple of holes that are going to go into that surface, and that is going to just, just come up like a geyser. And, and, and you're going to see massive public reaction against what's been done to their middle class life. The working poor of this country have suffered long enough, and, and they're not going to take it. And I think you know that. I know that. Mayor Bloomberg knows that. Mm -hmm. Warren Buffett knows that. And so they can keep talking about this all they want. But if there isn't serious action right away, what you see on Wall Street, that'll be known as that's where it began. And, you know, I went down there when I made my last movie. It was just me with some police crime tape. And I wrapped it around uh, mm -hmm. the stock exchange as my form of protest. And I was very nervous doing that because I saw the cops coming. And, and, uh, and I'm thinking, I, I saw one officer starts toward me. And I said, sir, I'm just really just making a movie. I'm just, just a little comedy. And, uh, <laughs> yeah. and, he, said, and he, said, he said to me, that's okay, Mike. He said, these guys in here... They've lost so much money out of our police right. pension fund of, as a result right. of what they've done. Right. He said to me, "You just New York cop. He said, you just take all the time you want. <laughs> but I wanted to give you this time to react to this, this execution last night, the death of Troy Davis. Let me start by reading what you wrote on your website today, and then you can take it from there. I encourage everyone I know to never travel to Georgia, never buy anything made in Georgia, to never do business in Georgia. I will ask my publisher to pull my book from every Georgia bookstore, and if they won't do that, I will donate every dime of every royalty my book makes in Georgia to help defeat the racists and killers who run that state. I ask all Americans with a conscience to shun anything and everything to do with the murderous state of Georgia. To say that's strong is to, is to understate it. Why does this case engender that reaction from you? A, a man was murdered last night in our name. You know, I'm part of this country. I may not be a resident of the state of Georgia, but last time I looked, Georgia was in the United States of America. And they murdered a man that they did not know uh, committed. There was so much evidence. So mm -hmm. many people have recanted their testimony. No DNA, no gun. No, I mean, it's just, it's just so... I'm just so outraged by this. I just got word before we came on the air. I asked my publisher this morning, I want you to stop shipping books of my book to, to Georgia. I want you to pull the books out of there. I don't want a dime being made. I don't want to make a dime off that state until that state acts to change things. And they just told me that uh, they, can't, uh, they can't recall the books. So I'm going to go to the next step then. I'm going to write uh, a, a big check uh, uh, to the Innocence Project, who have gotten hundreds of people exonerated who are sitting in prisons. And, and since the Supreme Court reinstated the death penalty, well over 100 people uh, who were on death row, mm -hmm. who we were going to execute, we have d then discovered they were, they were falsely uh, convicted and they were let set free. Well, they almost died. This Innocence Project is, is a great organization. I'm, I'm also going to uh, fund whatever I, voter drives in Georgia. There's 600,000 African Americans in the last election that were not registered to vote. I will get behind whatever drive uh, there is in Georgia to register our, our fellow uh, Americans who are African Americans so that they have a chance to have their voice heard. This has got to be stopped. We are a civil, civilized nation, and yet we do not join mm -hmm. the other civilized nations of this planet when we do things like this. Yeah. They didn't just almost die. We almost killed them. That's the point, right?